Monroe County woman charged two years ago with killing her eight-month-old son now free, but her boyfriend is serving life in prison after prosecutors determined he hit and killed the small baby. Inslee Nichols joins us in studio to explain what prosecutors found in the case. Frank and Lori, I sat down with District Attorney Jonathan Adams earlier today. He explained that although prosecutors found Latorica Allen not responsible for her son's death, it was ultimately text messages that show she played a role in not caring for the safety of her child. I think the hardest part is understanding how parents can be the ones that cause the death of the child in such a brutal manner. In August 2017, Latorica Allen and Sanchez Ussery were both charged with killing Sanchez Ussery Jr. Ussery Jr. died from liver injuries that likely killed him within 30 minutes. Uh, it was determined the mother was at work when the injuries took place, and so we knew that the father was the one that assaulted the child. District Attorney Jonathan Adams says that decision was based off Monroe County Sheriff's Office investigation. They also looked at Allen's responsibilities. They um, told her from the husband, from the father of the child, that, that quite frankly he didn't like the child, that he was upset with the child. The child was very loud, noisy, always crying, wasn't like his other children. After reviewing text messages, it was revealed Allen knew Ussery was upset with the child and knew he wasn't a safe person to leave the baby with. It was her negligent actions helped lead to the harm. Um, so it certainly varies, but this would be a typical um, sentence potentially with someone with no criminal history. Ellen was charged with child cruelty for leaving her son with Ussery. She received a 10 year sentence with two years to serve. Two weeks ago, Ussery pleaded guilty to felony murder. Guys, back to you. Thank you, Inslee. Allen spent two years in the Monroe County Jail awaiting trial, but was released from custody yesterday.